Good morning, guys. It's your girl, Jasmine Chardé. I'm trying to keep the light. There we go. Um, I hope everybody's having an amazing morning so far. It is Wednesday, and I just wanted to pop on here, 7, 16 a.m. I just wanted to pop on here and say good morning and give everybody just a little motivational pep talk uh, for today. It's the middle of the week, and it's kind of like, or what people call the hump day, where you're just like, mm, Monday then hit me, I'm ready for the weekend. I just want to come ahead and give a little push just to tell you guys to keep going. Keep pushing through, keep sticking through with your workouts, even if you have to slow your workouts down. This morning I did not get on the treadmill. It was because I left my shoes downstairs and I didn't feel like going over downstairs to get them and wake up my dogs. So, and I feel like that was an excuse. Like subconsciously, I think I left my shoes downstairs on purpose so that I would not have to get on the treadmill. Because I only work out in a certain pair of shoes. And I was just like, yeah, we're not going to do the treadmill today. But I still end up doing a 20 minute, a full 20 minute workout. I'm very sore. I'm still sore from yesterday. So I just want to tell you guys, you know, keep going. Keep pushing through. Keep fighting through. Get your assignments done. I know you may be tired. It's the middle of the week. Nobody really wants to do anything. The weekend is so close. But push through. Stay motivated. Stay animated. If you feel like you're drying out, grab your Bible and read a couple of verses from the Bible. I read yesterday and it kind of like the, it hit me. Oh, I wanted to share a uh, verse with you guys too, if you don't mind. Sorry, yeah, my phone goes off from 3 in the morning to 2 a.m. in the morning, literally. Um... I think, what did I read? So, yesterday morning, I read Isaiah 25. Like I told you guys, I read a chapter every morning and a chapter every night of the Bible just to stay in my word. And... I wanted to share this verse with you guys for this week. It's Isaiah chapter 25, verse 1. O Lord, King James Version. O Lord, thou art my God. I will exalt thee. I will praise thy name. For thou hast done wonderful things. Thy counsels of old are faithfulness and true. Thou hast made of a city and heap of a defensed city a ruin, a palace of strangers to be no city. It shall never be built. Therefore shall the strong people glorify thee, the city of the terrible nation shall fear thee. For thou hast been a strength to the poor, a strength to the needy in his distress, a refuge from the storm, a shadow from the heat, when the blast of the terrible ones is a storm against the wall. I read the whole chapter, but I only read verses 1, 2, 3, and 4 to you guys. And I just hope that it can be some motivation to you, help you get through your day, just resort on the fact that we have made it out of 2020, we are now into 2021. Be grateful that you made it to a new year. Yeah, I'm trying to keep the light out. I don't think my head is working. Be be thankful that you made it to a new day. Be thankful that you have another breath. And it's another chance to make moves, to better yourself spiritually, to better yourself emotionally, to better yourself uh, physically, to better yourself mentally. Stay, in, stay focused. Stay on topic. Push through. I don't care how tired you are. Push through. Like, yesterday was my full day of going through all of my things I do for my internship from 8 to 12, come home, eat. No, I'm sorry. I get up 540, work out, go walk Reese's and Coco, come back, take a shower, then go to my internship from 8 to 12, then come home, eat lunch, walk Reese's and Coco again, then I'm back at my job from 3 to 7, and then I have to be back at home, walk Reese's and Coco again, try to eat dinner, and then be in class from 6 to 9. And I actually stayed up last night and fulfilled an order. And I got in bed at 11 o'clock. It was like 11.15. You know, I'm trying to get in bed at 11 o'clock. Got in bed at like 11.15 last night, but I didn't go to bed until like 11.30 because, you know, I read my Bible. And I ended up getting caught up on TikTok <laughs> for like, 20 minutes so but i was in bed by 11 i but what i did not do i did not stretch last night because i was so tired and so sore but i should have stretched push through you guys push through today is going to be another long day for me but i'm extremely excited about it i'm loving my, loving my internship i miss working i love my job i signed up to work at my other job you know several shifts 
I am getting my assignments done. I have three assignments I have to get done today that I do tomorrow. And it's only the first week, first week of classes, guys. So just push through. Be motivated. I hope this video motivates somebody, helps somebody, push you through, uh, keep you keep you on the right track. I will try to do a motivational video every Wednesday. And I hope this inspires you to work a little harder. Even when you're tired and you feel like you have nothing left. If you can blink your eyes, if you can take a breath, keep pushing. Have an amazing day. Have an amazing day, guys, and I will see you Saturday.